Hello, hello everybody and welcome back to Crusader Kings 3 with your truly your first pair Prime Spiders. We are back with the Loyalist campaign and honestly this is an episode I am really, really scared of because uh, we don't have an heir. We are 80, oh we're only 18 years old. But yeah, look at our wife. <laughs> She's an adulterer and she is possessed so her health is fine though. Yeah, we'll see. We might want us to do somebody else as well. But yeah, this is an episode we... Uh, we <laughs> Well, I have been really scared of this episode. But anyway, we are back. We are back. We are back with the Loyalist campaign. And uh, let's see how we fare today. Let's see what's up, by the way. Because uh, we can change the contract. I don't really want to change the contract. Now, we have a murderer on the prowl. And somebody already said what we could do, and that was a really good tip, by the way, is get our spy master to find secrets in our own court. Now, in the last episode... This guy, this murderer, this mysterious man or woman, uh, said to us that the last kill was our father, right? And he or she said that this was his or her last present to us. So, yeah, I'm really, I'm really unsure when it comes to what that means. Because that could mean that we are next, but it could also mean that we are not next and he's going to stop now. Hopefully it's the last thing. But in any case, we should probably seduce somebody and see if we can get some bastard children. Because uh, right now we're not looking. We're not. Look where's the Where's the intrigue thing? There. Right now it's not looking very good for us. So maybe we should get a courtier or something. Uh, like that's our grandmother. That's. I don't think we should go with our grandmother right now. Uh, maybe we have somebody who's in prison. You, for example. Uh, you're of our dynasty, though. So I don't think that's a good. thing. A good idea. Do we have any other women? She's our guest. How old is she, anyway? 46 years old. Nah. It's not going to happen, is it? How about you? 56. No, that's too old. Okay, maybe... Because I believe there was this... How about one of your daughters? We're in Brittany, maybe. Oh, no. You. Yeah, you're good. Oh, it's kind of far away, though. I don't care. 40%. Oh, let's start it. We'll see. We'll see. Okay, I'm going to start the clock now, guys. Uh, what are we doing? We are fighting a holy war. All oh, right. Where's our troops at? Nowhere. Uh, should we? Can we? No, we can't do this yet. We need more money. Okay, so I do want to fight in the Holy War. Uh, I'd like to raise all the levies and men at arms, but I don't want to command it ourselves, I think. Because, I mean, we've been playing this in a risky way, right? This campaign has been a very risky thing. But right now, I don't feel like we can actually take any more risks. Okay, so you're the attacker. Uh, we should offer to join the war here, and we cannot do that. Because we're not defending the faith in the Holy War. Right, we probably figured this out last episode. I do apologize. Let's uh, just have the clock running and hopefully we can seduce this woman. And hopefully we can also... What is this? Restricted vassals move... Oh, right, yeah, that's because the killer is on the prowl. Okay, for now, I think we help our king, I guess. Because Endgame, guys, again, is going to become a king. Uh... Yes, we'll be on the council. Absolutely. We'll be the spy master. Absolutely. Sure. Although, yeah, we're better off being a diplomat. But, yeah. Okay, so what do you like? Uh, you probably like... We'll go for this one. Bad impressions, damn it. My warriors will be ready to fight. There comes the crusade. Very good. Very good indeed. Now give me a child, damn it. Just give me a bloody child. Nobody's really good when it comes to... Well, you're good enough, I suppose. And we'll assign you. Yeah, sure. Now, are we going to put our spy master over there to figure out who did all this? Let's do it. Let's do it. Let's try and figure out who's behind all these killings. And we have low county control. We need to do something about that. Oh, we're already working on it. Good. Now, we need this woman to become pregnant. Come on. What is happening? You're a lunatic now. Okay, maybe we'll get rid of her. 
And we're gonna gain a lot of stress for that, so that's not gonna happen. Maybe we can request a divorce, though. So... We have sinful traits, that's an issue. Uh, could we potentially bribe you? Uh, we could ask for forgiveness. That could be good. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's do that. Very good. Very good. Now. You'll still... You still won't be able to accept. We could sway you, but we're already scheming to become somebody's lover. Uh... Who's scheming again? Nobody's scheming, scheming against... Yeah, so leave. Uh, where's where's our? There we go. Okay, yeah, this is probably not going to happen. So I'd rather s sway the Pope. We don't have an unstable connection. Come on. I'd rather sway the Pope and see if we, see if we can get a divorce out. Because uh, actually, we have we have a reason to imprison her, and she might leave our court. That is not good. Okay, damn it, we need a child. Oh, 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 oh. While performing his duties as my spy master, Matok has uncovered secrets held by my chancellor, Jacques. The truth is finally revealed to me. He was the man who plotted to kill my father, Count Giselbert. Could it have been avoided had I only known sooner? So you killed all those people. He probably did. Oh, God. Okay, so we have a murder secret. We're going to expose his secret here. Boom. There's the secret. And we are going to imprison this guy. He will not succeed. He will just leave our court. Ah, oh, damn it. That is being annoying. Well, let's chase him out of our court at least. We finally got the bastard. Yeah, he's fled to the countryside. Ah, we can't do this because we're compassionate. That's annoying. Traitor! Okay, this could come back to bite us in the behind. Because, <laughs> uh, let's be honest here. He, he, um... He said something like, Don't try to intervene. Don't try to catch me. I will just come for you. Right? Ugh. I don't like this at all. And we need a child, damn it. Oh, we have a new leash. Good, you're still a carling. And your heir is also a carling man. If only we could marry her, eh? Maybe we could seduce her. Yeah, it's not gonna happen. Come on, we need a child. That's literally the only thing we need right now. Leash one war, good. Ask head of faith for gold, but he'll lose opinion. That is not great. How about a divorce now? Will not accept. Yeah. Okay, let's get some opinion up. Uh, we don't want to do that. Oh man, this campaign. I am so anxious right now because we, we could get killed by that lunatic. There's the crusade. Raise the armies. Raise the armies. There we go. Here we go, guys. Okay, we're going for Jerusalem. Uh, uh, let's play this. How are we going to do this? Let's uh, move them to Alexandria-ish. Yes, 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 yes. There we go. Request a divorce. Yes, we are Chancellor as well. Great. I am sorry, but we need another wife. And preferably somebody... Wow, the music is amazing. But I'm going to lower the volume just a tiny bit because I can't, I, I can't hear myself think at the moment. Um, and I need to think right now because we need a wife that is something like prolific or something. Okay, is there a chance of children here? Let's do age difference 10. Um, what is this? Pure-blooded. More fertility. That is good, but she's 15 years old. 
Um, a boost to her health, though. And she could make a valuable ally. Uh, yeah, but... Okay, so it is going to take her a few years to... Okay, chance of children will be high. Let's go for it, guys. Let's go for it. We need, uh, we need an heir. We need it now. Like, come on. We need an heir. <laughs> we're 20 years old, so we're, we're gonna have to wait three years three years before she comes of age, and then we need to start breeding. Come on. And in the meantime, we could just start seducing people. We don't, we, we shouldn't, uh, we shouldn't do this. Um, let's see if there's anybody in our court that we might want to seduce. How old are you? You're 53, you're 34, you're 35. And you're lustful, yes, please. Yes, please. We're gonna recruit you. There we go, you're in our court. Now we are going to seduce you. And hopefully, we'll get another bastard kid out of that. Where's our army? There it is. And we're not gonna lead the troops ourselves this time, guys. I know we usually do it in this Let's Play, but right now we really cannot afford to do it. I mean, honestly, we, we just we can't we just can't afford to do it. Not gonna happen. Sorry, guys. Not gonna happen. Why? Right. So, anything we can do for our leash, we should probably sway him as well, because we need to uh, need to be a king. That's where this last play is heading. But first, we need to secure our bloodline. Um. Flowers. Sure. What did I do wrong? Come on. Ah, mods. Good. Are you a carling? You are a carling. Good. Oh, hi. Did they become independent? No, they didn't, right? They did. So, who's our liege now? Our liege is... Ah, uh, Kentule. Okay, we're gonna have to sit this one out, guys. What happened to the Empire? What happened to the Empire? I feel like it's split in half. No, it's the Empire of Italia. And then we have the Empire of Francia, so it's split into two empires. Okay, well, I, I'm not really sure if that's good, but it's fine. Um, is there anything that's gonna give us more... Yeah, Patriarch. That could be good. Yeah, we should probably start befriending people as well. It's always good to have some friends. Okay, you know what? We'll get out here, because that's a count. And yes, we will be the Chancellor of Italia. <clears throat> what do we have for... Um... Okay, we have Siege Equipment. That's good. I need to set a timer. Damn it. Okay, let me set a timer real quick. Oh, this episode is so stressful. I feel like death is lurking around the corner. Like, it's it's just everywhere. I don't like this. I don't like this at all. Uh, Riddle poems. It was great, wasn't it? We have smoldering chemistry. Nah, damn it. Okay, they're moving away. Can we marry? We can marry. Good. Send proposal. Excellent. Are we married? We are married. Good. Very good. Very good. We'll, uh, we'll have this uh, scheme go on for a while, though, because it's only five months. So... We'll keep it running for a bit. And in the meantime, we'll try to capture some prisoners. Can we ransom anybody? Yeah, we can. Uh, but not for money, it seems. Yeah, we can ransom you for money. Sure, we'll need the extra money. Yeah, fine. There we go. Ransom accepted. Siege one. Prisoners taken. Good. Okay, any other... Should probably, probably put the C. Start moving over to there. There. We'll be able to supply the troops there. So let's check whether we can ransom anybody right now. I think so. No, we cannot. We can ask our head of faith for gold. And let's actually do that. Let's just get some gold in. Praise St. Matthew, here comes the tax refund. Indeed, and that will allow us to pay for the ships, so that's good. <coughs> OK, 
Okay. They won't be able to besiege us there. Please get some children. Are we the problem? They're both heterosexual. So that shouldn't be an issue. Where's our troops? There they are. Okay, let's see if we can go to... Uh... Oh, 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 yes, please. A shiver of anticipation finds its way up my spine as I find my way to... I can't pronounce this. Uh, her chambers. As soon as she opens the door, she looks at me timidly, smiles worriedly, and pulls me inside with a grip on my shirt. Very good. Let us meet again. And we are now lovers, right? Yes, we are now lovers. Very good. Now, we also want to seduce our wife. Yeah. Let's seduce our wife, eh? Okay, only 34 men. Uh, hopefully we can... We've tried this before, haven't we? Ah, oh, it's not going to work, is it? Okay, get out of there. We don't want to lose the army. And we are going to lose the army. Well, at least we inherited a county. <laughs> Ugh. Damn it. And that gets rid of a lot of our... Ah, oh, damn it. I keep trying it. It doesn't work. Why can't we... Uh, fornicator. You, that's our uh, lover, so we don't want to do that. A swollen belly. Yes. I immediately knew why. She's with child. I never thought it would come to this. But actually, I did think it would come to this. Hopefully, it's a boy. And hopefully, we can uh, legitimize this guy. What did we get, by the way? We get, we got a county. Uh, where is it? Samur. That's that one, right? Okay. So, do we have any anybody in the court who could potentially become a? Uh, we could ransom you. Not gonna happen, is it? No. Anybody in court who could potentially be a vassal like you? We could. Uh, if we grant you this title, you will be our. You will be our vassal, and you're a good marshal. So let's have you. Let's have you in our court. Uh, we don't want to imprison anybody. We do want... Uh, where's the Wazdi? Come on. There we go. There's the Wazdi. We do want to have you as a marshal, though, because you're kind of good. Now, we lost the entire army, which is annoying. A good pregnancy. Very good. Whew, I feel like we're getting out of the woods now, which is good. Because we need an heir. So we just need to we just need to survive for nine more months. Nine more months is, all, is like all it takes. So... I don't want her to... Yeah, we'll pay off her loans. I'd rather do that. I don't want her to get a hook on us. Not right now. Good. Good. At least one of war. Ech. He's left the war. Yeah, this crusade. Oh, actually, we just had a. We uh, we're winning. We're winning because of war score over here. Yeah, next time we'll probably stay with the army, but we need a bigger army. We just need. We need more money. We need more everything. We need more influence, basically. I'm gonna expose the lover's secret. Can we legitimize this guy? Legitimized bastard, there we go. Boom. Welcome to the family. Your future is bright indeed. Yes! Ooh. Okay, now we are sinful though. So that is not great. We are a sinner. Um, people won't like us that much, but it is what it is. We have a son. And we have a daughter. Good. We have a son and a daughter now. I love it. Okay, that is good. That is good. This is a step, guys. Okay, now we're going to check the duchy, and hopefully we can add a law, which is going to be feudal elective. We cannot add a law, because we're at war. Okay, fine. Fine, fine, fine. Ah, we can't do this. We need more money first. So probably what we need to do now is we need to... We need to have some peace time, right? And we need to check what our leash is doing. And actually, okay, hear me out, guys. 
We've had a couple of discussions on the... What is this? Go go away. We've had a, a couple of discussions on the channel when it comes to um, intrigue against the Carling dynasty. Because, again, this is a loyalist campaign, so we don't want to move against the Carling dynasty. But what we, will, what we could do is start claimant factions to get another Carling on the throne and maybe get a peaceful transfer of power out of it. So getting a peaceful transfer of power usually means that we need about... Well, I don't know the exact percentage, but I I I feel like that if we are at let's say 180 percent, then they are probably going to agree with it. Right now, the empire is in shambles. We have Italia and we have Francia. Um, what we could start doing is see if we can get a claimant on, like if we can start a claimant faction uh, with, for example, her. Uh, she's a princess. Can we also get a claimant faction with? The, the ruling queen, king, sorry, the ruling, no, the ruling, the empress of Francia. Because I wouldn't mind giving her this territory back. Because they were idiots for, uh... there we go, look at that, good, Empire of Italia. So, this is a question I'm going to ask you guys. What do you think about this? Because if I were to play Crusader Kings, like, in a more aggressive way, way where we could create and usurp titles let's say like not in a loyalist campaign way i would probably do something like this just so that she can get more power because i think she it's better to have her as a queen than him as a king probably yeah let me know what you guys think about this i would consider moving against the carling dynasty uh in this way because you're moving you you you're basically moving against the Carling Dynasty for the Carling Dynasty, right? You're doing what's best for the realm. And I think it's better for the realm to have Francia and Italia united instead of divided. But let me let me know what you guys think about this. I think it's a really interesting, uh, interesting question. So, but for now we need to see some peacetime because we need to get our money up, we need to get our troops up, uh, we need to we need to start moving against the Muslims, I think. Well, we're losing the war, aren't we? Yeah, we probably are. Well, we still have a lot of troops over here. So do they, though. There's 17,000 men there. They're losing supplies fast. Ah, let's go. Let's go. It's only 1,400 men, but still, it's 1,400 men, right? I'll try to be more careful this time. I guess I've been playing uh, Roma Aeterna too much, where we could just move them in and win every bloody battle that we fight. That's not happening right now. And look at the money we're losing. Ech. So, this is our player air, right? Yeah, good. Okay, how are we doing? We are not doing that well, are we? No. Good. Losing some stress is good. Okay, I'll try to be more careful. And there's the defeat. St. George has abandoned us indeed. Let's get let's get home. This is not the first time we're losing uh Okay, she's with child again. I'm not going to legitimize the boss at this time. Not not right now. Okay, good. We can ransom the Shaikh. That is good. That's a bit of money. And I'd like to get another men-at-arms regiment. Uh, this time we're going to go for armed footmen. What is life without love? I mean, come on. What is life without love? You tell me. Okay, yeah, I really want to get some armored footmen because I feel like we need some more elite troops uh, in our uh, in our army. Loyalty or fear? As their duke, my vassals owe me their allegiance. My word is law, but how much obedience without devotion? How much is obedience without devotion worth? In times of crisis, a slow response or a half-hearted effort can lead to disaster. Can I afford such a risk? I will win their unwavering loyalty. Yeah, that's fine. 
Good. Good, another child on the way. We need to get a couple of children. I don't care about succession and the realm breaking. I really don't care about that. I care about uh, surviving right now. Because we were on the brink of losing here, guys. It was really, really... Uh, we are not going to expose this. No. Nope. And... Oh, 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 oh. We need to add a law. We need to go for feudal elective here. Let's add that. Very good. Now, let's look at succession. Uh, we are going to vote for... Ugh. Yeah, our son. How many electors do we have? Okay, you don't have any votes. You have votes, though. But looking at this, unless they both vote for the same unit... Okay, that could be an issue, but uh, uh, we just need to keep a buffer. I'll be able to work that, that's fine. Yeah, I know we can use subtitles, but we can't really, can we? Ah, Gilbert, Gilbert de Menou. Okay, you're actually a better candidate, so we are going to vote for Gilbert right now. Yeah. Get him back in our court. We need some more people in our court. We need more knights. We need more more anything. Like we need a good council. Um Okay. Okay. I think we're doing fine, guys. We're we're we're, we're okay. Uh let's look at succession though. Let's look at title loss. So we're still going to lose titles. Why? Confederate partition, but we are wait. We don't have the bloody Britney uh title. Uh. Can somebody please make that? Because <laughs> we kind of need that. Yeah, we kind of need that, don't we? Because right now, our primary title... Right now, our primary title is going to somebody else. But will be the liege, though. Okay, so in that case, if you are the heir to the county of Vannis, uh, we might want to make you our heir, don't we? It's a problem for later. Yeah, let me, let me know what you guys think about the faction. Because um, I feel like that's a that's a good thing to do right now. I feel like we need to we need to unite Frankia again. Same goes for uh, for this. Uh, no, wait, East Frankia was never a was it? I don't know. We need a kingdom title. What kingdom title? Do we, yeah, we have Brittany over here, so we somebody should be able to create this. Our leash should be able to create this. Uh, we should sway him, by the way. Ah, I just pinned him. Start swaying this guy. And we cannot do this. Because you're a child. Ech. How much gold do you have? You have quite a bit of gold. You could create a kingdom. Come on, do it. Oh, and we should start befriending people like our spy master. Well, that's not what we're doing, because we're not fighting inside the realm. I would like to fight against Wessex, though. Or maybe Cornwall. Yeah. Yeah, that could be good. That could be good. Establish a bit of an outpost over here. Sure. 
Okay, yeah, I, I feel like that's a plan. Uh, if we can get Cornwall up. If we can get a vassal in Cornwall, then that will uh, that will expand our influence just a bit. So that, that would be good, guys. Let's try that. Uh, we need 90 for that. Okay, good. Actually, we might want to do some building right now. Because there's still a lot that we could build. So, Although, it's not that bad. I wouldn't mind a trade port. Oh! Ew! As a stray arrow whizzes past my head in the yard, I feel nothing. No fear, no anger, no panic. This has been par for the course recently. I feel as if I exist behind a curtain, keeping me from feelings in the world, and I am so bloody tired. I think I will go back to bed. No, don't go back to bed. That's not how you cure depression. Ugh. What is the meaning of it all? Why do we go through these motions day after day after day after day? Motivation and energy escapes me. As my life sinks into grey dullness, I feel like I should be panicking, but even that is beyond me now. That is such an awful state to be in. He needs help. He needs help. You need help, Maurice. Okay, we're gonna save up for a trade port in Brest. What is this? Oh come on, don't don't do this. Don't do this to us. Okay, we should probably marry you off to somebody with a lot of alliance power, so we can uh, this can be reset. Just reset the defaults. There you go. Uh, alliance power, please. Arnold Carling. Hmm. 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 Yes, please. Very good. The Duke of Bavaria. Our ally. He has a lot of troops, so that would be really good. That's going to be really good, yeah. Um, could we maybe be more than friends? Mm -hmm. Such a pleasant man. Oh, yeah, right. We were befriending our spy master. Okay, uh, con convert to local culture. What is the culture of our capital? Is, is it Italian? Yeah, you're Italian. I don't want to be Italian just yet. Um, what I do want to do, because I keep this, this keeps being thing. I'd like to keep these pinned so that whenever I can trigger them, I want to trigger them. Uh, I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna pin the suicide, obviously. Okay, we'll go for a we'll go for a trade port first. And then we'll start moving for a crusade because we're still a sinner and I don't want to be actually we should probably go for, on a pilgrimage right now, shouldn't we? Ah, let's let's go let's go on a pilgrimage first because um let's go to the Vatican. Fine. We really need to get our uh, we really need to become more than a sinner. Because people are not going to like us for this, so... Yeah. Gah, I always like this one. Passing by the campfire, one of my fellow travelers is telling a story he once heard about some duke. To... Rokus? I don't know how you pronounce this. To, to Rokus Lauter. La laughter. I don't, I don't know. I don't know. They all fall silent when I approach, except for the storyteller. Ah, don't worry, my lord. You're nothing like the curl in this story. I think it's curl. And it's like like in The Walking Dead, right? Curl! Oh no, that's Coral. Right, anywho. It's about the Duke of some far away place called Anjou. Yeah, well, that's that's about us, isn't it? Well, anyway, really now, tell me more of this Duke. That's probably how I would respond as well. The arrival. I'm finally here, body and soul, at the great church of Vaticano. As the bishop offers me blessings, I reflect on everything that had happened for God to bring me that that had to happen for God to bring me here at this moment in time. Wow, that is a lot actually. I have walked the holy path, so that is very good. Hopefully, ah, we're still a sinner, but we're almost there, guys. We're almost there, and we can ask for gold now. So that's good. Let's ask. It's good to be home. I don't want to declare, declare these wars. There comes the tax refund. Very good. Now I'd like to get a trade port in Brest. Oh, and we need to convert cultures here. Jeez, I didn't even uh, didn't even notice. What culture is this? Breton. Right. Let's uh, start converting because uh, I want this to be French because she is French as well, right? Yeah. Huh. Alrighty. 
Okay, we're almost there. We're almost there. Because we need to get more money in, guys. Lost in thought. I wonder what's on this mind. Pensive. Pensive is good. Pensive is good. Let's construct this. Uh, oh, hi. Uh, yeah, we'll exchange letters. Absolutely. Yep. We just had this in the previous episode as well. Are you trying to make me feel like an idiot? Your last letter was so... Blah, blah, blah. Why? Why? I used to value our friendship. What are you doing? Ugh. Good, another perk for the diplomacy lifestyle. That is great. Uh, we stand for the defense of the realm. Absolutely. Right, um, I, yeah, I think we're just going to go for the befriend scheme. But actually, we should go for thoughtful. And actually, we should probably get Bellum Justin. Let's do that. And also, know thyself would be really good in this Let's Play. Man, we, we dodged a bullet today, guys. We dodged a bullet. And actually, I would like some more children, to be honest. But two sons is good. Two sons is better than no sons. So, yeah. Health-wise, we're still feeling fine, which is good. She's feeling great. Ah, good. Okay, we got that under control. She's pregnant again. That's good. Very good. Uh, let us... Everything is under control. Very good. And we are known far and wide right now. That's going to be good for marriage. So, great. Great. A lot of good stuff. Now, I, I really need our leash to make the Duchy of Brittany. Oh, no. Oh, damn it. That is sad. A new claimant. Uh, Why? Well, I don't think they'll be able to, uh... I don't think they'll be able to do much harm. Yeah, see it done. Very good. That means that we can go to war again, finally. How I've missed war. I know we're in debt. Uh, we're gonna wait for our coffers to fill up just a little bit. Because I don't want to be in... I don't want to be too much in debt, to be honest. Now, what we could do is, um, I, I believe we can give these territories to our son. And actually, we should probably start on the next claim in Devon. And then we can take out Cornwall, probably. And that gives, a, that, that gives us a bit of a, uh, a foothold over the channel. Comfort of a friend. Very good. Okay, we have 17 right now. We're getting more money in. Let's uh, start moving towards this. And we'll declare war here. Uh, well, how, how many troops do you have? Okay, so technically we should be able to do this ourselves without getting any allies in. But you never know. And we should probably not go over like so. We should probably take a bit of an angle here. No. What is life without love? Okay, good. We have the small harbor in Cre uh, Brest. That is good. Uh, we're losing a lot of money at the moment, which is unfortunate, but we can't really help it. They're pulling in allies. Let's wait here for a bit, have them move in and take these allies down. Are we commanding this ourselves? No, we are not. Good. We don't want to command this right now. I would like some more money, but it's not going to happen. Okay, there's the enemy. I think we can take this and then move on. And I'd rather do it like this. Hopefully we'll get some prisoners out of this. Because we need money. And actually we might have just waited to... What is this? It's a defensive war. We might want to help our liege here. Hello. There we go. And we're not a war leader, so we can't. Okay. Well, sounds clear. Then we'll focus on our own war. And luckily we didn't have to pull any allies in. Okay, we got a little bit of money out of that. But it would be good if we could... No, we're going to win this. We are going to win this. And there's devotion. Good. We are no longer a sinner. We're dutiful. That's great. Ah, damn it, a thieves guild. I don't like that. Ugh. Okay, we're going to win this. That's good. Hopefully we'll get, we'll get some prisoners out of this as well. We are not getting any prisoners out. But the KD ratio is pretty good. So we'll, we'll take this city and maybe get some prisoners there. 
And we have an injured spy master. We can't really help it. I'm I'm sorry. Okay, uh intrigue. But more importantly, scheming. Oh hi, Burgundy. You're not a Carling, are you? Gwent. I liked Gwent in The Witcher. It was a really, really good game. Okay, Liege, hi. I want to sway you. We really need to be able to improve our domain size. What? Come on. Uh, sorry. Walk. Done. Good. Now, uh, what we could do is give this place to our son. But I don't really want to. No, we have time. We have time. We don't have to do that right now. So, we have a knight here. You're too old. You're not going to be able to get some children out. That could be a good thing, though. Yeah, that could be a good thing. Okay, all yours. All yours. Now, I'm curious. How many troops are you giving us? Um, where do we see this? Okay, so, here's the contracts. Um, since they're not really liking us, I believe, this goes down as well. Right? How does that work? I don't know. Reduced because we're not the right for liege, okay. Title allegiance. Uh, it had something to do with title allegiance as well, I believe. I'm not really sure about that anymore. I don't know. I'm gonna figure this out. I'm gonna figure this out. But if you guys know how this works exactly, because I would like to know. If you guys know how this works exactly, let me know. Actually, I saw some other... Alright, that's just Feudal and Republic. Right. Okay, so now we just uh, keep the clock running, I guess. Um... Oh. Let's keep running. And if we can help our liege, then I'd like to do that. Yeah, but we're involved in a war that's, that we can't really uh, do anything with. There's the Bellum Justin perk. Pretty good. Unlock that. Good. Yeah, we're getting more levies in. That's good. Ah, come on. It's a big misunderstanding. You know that. Are we swaying our liege? No, we're not swaying our liege. Are we? No. Yeah. War declared on liege. There we go. Duke of Bavaria. That's our ally. That is our ally. Uh, that is annoying. That's the timer as well. Alrighty, guys. We're going to figure this one out in the next episode. I am really glad we survived this one. Let me be honest here. Hope you enjoyed. Hope to catch you on the next. Thank you for watching. Bye-bye.